there is a dietitian he has two types of food food x and food y now let me show you a table there this table tells us about the vitamin contents in the food x and y so for food x there are three units of vitamin a per kg for food y there are four units of vitamin a per kg similarly for vitamin c there are two units per kg for food x and five units per kg for food y now the dietitian wants to mix the two types of food such that in the mixture the vitamin a content is at least 10 units and vitamin c content is at least 15 units now food x costs rupees 30 per kg and food y that costs rupees 45 per kg now the dietitian wants to minimize the cost of such a mixture and we need to help him so what can we do since we are students of mathematics we first need to write this information in mathematical form so let us formulate and to formulate this problem we need variables let's say the mixture contains x kilograms of food x and y kilograms of food y now the cost of 1 kg of food x that's 30 so the cost of x kg of food x that will be 30x similarly cost of 1 kg of food y that's 45 so cost of y kg of food y that's 45y let's say that the total cost of the mixture that's z so what would be z that's nothing but 30x plus 45y now the dietitian wants to minimize the total cost of the mixture that is the value of z so what is the objective function here that's minimize z equals 30x plus 45y now we also have some conditions in the mixture the vitamin a content should be at least 10 units x kg of food x so 3x units from food x and 4 units of vitamin a per kg from food y so 4y units from food y so this means that the total vitamin content that is 3x plus 4y this should be greater than or equal to 10 similarly for the vitamin c content that should be at least 15 units 2x units of vitamin c from food x and 5y units of vitamin c from food y so the total vitamin c content that's 2x plus 5y and this should be greater than or equal to 15 so these two inequalities are the constraints of a linear programming problem also remember one thing x and y they cannot be negative so we have two more constraints x is greater than or equal to zero and y is greater than or equal to zero so how can we formulate this problem minimize z equals 30x plus 45y and this is subject to the constraints 3x plus 4y is greater than or equal to 10 2x plus 5y is greater than or equal to 15 x is greater than or equal to 0 and y is greater than or equal to 0 so this is how we formulate a linear programming problem